back at halftime at the Memphis Coliseum. With me here at halftime, I have three young Marylanders who have come down here at an, on an adventure trying to play, break into the MISL. From Silver Springs, Maryland, we have John Marucci. John, tell me, what are you trying to do down here? Well, I'm trying to train, get professional training, and uh, certainly make the pro team within a few years. Uh, try and do our best and learn all we can, you know, in the good environment of professional training. Why did you come down here particularly, John? Well, I, I didn't want to go to college my first year. I wanted to take a year off, and I was really interested in professional soccer, so a friend of mine told me to try the MISL. So I came down here for a two-day tryout, and I was invited back for the preseason camp. And uh, so I came down, and I've been here ever since, since September 11th. How is it working out for you? Oh, it's fantastic. I got, I'm doing just fine. Doing great. On my left here is Lee Kessler. Lee comes from Sykesville. And Lee is also down here. They're not under contract, let me say. They are down here paying their own way, hoping to break into the MISL. Uh, Lee, tell me, uh, what brought you down? Well, the coaches from the Pittsburgh Spirit, uh, they recommended I come to Memphis. Um, you know, Memphis was starting a reserve program. It was just getting off the ground. Uh, I wanted some good exposure, you know, and to train under professional coaches. So, you know, I gave them a call. You know, they looked over my resume, and I came down here and gave them my best shot, and I made the reserve team, and here we are today. Do you play in a local league, then, or do you play against the Memphis Americans in scrimmage? How does it work down here? Okay, we play in a local league. Um, it's just a men's league, men open A league, just like in Baltimore. Um, we also scrimmage against the Americans. We've played them twice so far. We've lost both times, but, you know, the coaches, they've seen a lot of improvement with the team and the players, and they're pretty high on the situation, totally. I see. And on my right, we have Scott Bretner, who's a goalkeeper with the uh, ponies, the American ponies, they call you down here. Is it not, Scott? Yeah, my uh, club team back home is called Montgomery United Ponies, and I've gotten most of my experience through them. And this summer, I decided to give it a try and give it a shot at the MISL. And I was here in August, and they weren't that interested in me, but then gave me a call during December, and I've been here ever since. I'm trying to get enough experience to make it a, a team soon and have to get a little lucky. It's tough breaking in the league. Well, uh, Scott, how long are you going to uh, give this? Uh, when are you going to decide whether you should go forward with it or uh, return to Baltimore, perhaps? Well, I'm only 18, so I, I know I still have a lot more learning to go. I have to get more experience, and this is where I'm going to get it. And I'm not setting a limit on when I'm going to give it all up and go back home. But I'd like to make it within a few years. Uh, in, in a situation tonight, like uh, when your uh, home team is playing uh, your uh, ab uh, adopted team, as it were, how do you call that one? Who are you cheering for tonight? I have to cheer for Memphis. Memphis? Yeah. How about you, Lee? Uh, Lee? Well, there's no place like home, but you know, the guys on the Memphis team, you know, they're really good guys. Uh, you know, we like working with them. We enjoy them a lot. Uh, Got to root for your friends. How about you, John? Well, uh, I just want to see good soccer either way. You know, I don't really mind who wins, although I do have a lot of friends on the Memphis team now since I've been here so long. And uh, I'd, like, I'd like to see a very good game overall and good soccer to promote the game. Anybody you'd like to say uh, hello to back home? Yeah, I'd like to wish my mom a happy birthday. Her birthday's on Monday, oh, nice. March 4th. So happy birthday, Mom. How about you, John? I'd just like to say hi to my dad. He had heart surgery in uh, December, and uh, he's doing really well, and I'm just praying for him and wishing that he gets better real good. I'm sure he's very proud of you. And Scott? I'd like to say hi to my parents, if they can watch it, and Jeff and Kim. That's about it. Okay, well, 